Well, good day everyone. Today we have a 2002 Mazda RX-7 Spirit R Type A. This was the final year in Japan for production of this FD model. It's a very historical car, really fun to drive from what everyone has been saying. I've never driven one before, but I've driven in one. A lot of people do V8 conversions, etc. But I love the rotary, even though I'm very scared to own one myself because that maintenance cost must be ridiculous because not everyone can work on rotaries. Anyway, the very first uh, model company to create one, to build one of these is Kyosho and then Auto Art followed here recently. There is a black one and also blue. There is also white version and if you guys are really into the old school ones, there's the, the very first gen and the Kaisuki Takahashi Initial D Edition. So let's get this thing off its display case. Let's see what we have here. All right, so we got four screws on the bottom and a couple wires with two little rubber or elastic bands. I always hate taking these things off. Man, this is taking me forever. I can't seem to get this wiring off the, uh, the display case, but let's see. Yep, still going. It's giving me a hard time. I'll eventually get there. Man. All right, looks like I need extra help. Be right back. Here you go, this should work. All right, time to cut these two wires. One's, one's done and here's the second one. Awesome. All right, looks good. So that wire protrudes into the trunk, so you just gotta get it off this little loop. And there it goes. And then in the front for the hood, I gotta get that one out. And it's gone, we're good. All right, let's check this out. Uh, looks pretty good. Ah, here we go. This will let the doors open. So we gotta get this hook and rubber or elastic band off. Keeps the door secured for shipping. Before they used to tape the doors on these old, on the older models, but now they've come up with a different way of doing it. I uh, don't need that, I can toss it. Hmm. All right, let's look at it. The trunk is very detailed. So you can see there's a, the cover inside there. Really high quality stuff we're looking at here. Hey, kitty. So auto art has come a long way when it comes to detail, especially on these newer models. They don't feel as cheap. I'm liking the fact that they're putting hood stops on their models now, very high quality. The hinges on the hood and trunk are also high quality as well. If you're familiar with the older auto art um, stuff, they, they actually look pretty cheap. The engine bay is really detailed. BBS wheels really stand out. The red Recaro seats are nice. The interior, I can't say anything bad about it. Really high quality model and it definitely shows. Definitely worth the, the price. Ah, price. The price is actually $170. That's what I paid for this one here shipped. So they're producing high volume, but, but believe it or not, it will be sold out soon and prices will start rising. So I think this one is definitely one to collect. So let's inspect it here. Yep, so all the panels look really good. The paint is very, very, very good. No complaints in that department. So yeah, let's go ahead and close all the doors. Bye bye hood. And last door. Sweet. Oh yeah, flip up lights. We definitely need to bring these back into style. So hashtag bring back flip, flip ups. It's kind of reminiscent of the early 90s and part of the 80s where flip up lights were the stuff. So there you have it, 2002 Mazda RX-7 Spirit R.